Hey guys, another gaming video clip. The last one I know was ages ago, but um, this is one I was playing this and I thought I'm going to do a video of this. It's actually a really cool game. This is the Shadow of Mordor, um, Lord of the Rings. It's the Game of the Year edition, so it's the old one, not the new one that they're just releasing or just have released. I can't remember the release date for it, but I got this, picked it up on a sale, and I watched a couple of videos of it first and thought it looked kind of cool, so I thought I'd give it a go. First thing you notice jumping into this game is the controls are different from what you would expect. Uh, for example, shift isn't sprint, it's spacebar. Um, shift is kind of, yeah, it's, it's, the controls are different. Um, but oddly enough, unlike other games where they have a different take on the control setup, this game only takes you maybe half an hour to get used to it. Actually, after an hour or two of playing, you completely forget that the controls are different at all. They just feel so natural and normal. It's it's odd, because even I find even jumping into Assassin's Creed after a long time of not playing it, the controls feel kind of odd. Um, but this game is very much Assassin's Creed Lord of the Rings edition. It's If you like Assassin's Creed games, you'll love this. You can see the um, the combat is nice and fluid. You get the, the mouse prompt right mouse button to counter so when somebody comes to attack you you can hit it counter hit it counter um, which is, is quite cool you get a, a hit streak building up as well now you have different weapons you've got your sword which is what I'm using in this combat um, you've also got a dagger for doing stealthy 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 you've got a bow for doing ranged and each weapon can be inscribed with different runes different runes will affect your your combat styles in different ways so you can build the weapons for your playstyle um, you will find though you'll just jump in and doing like this I mean this is a specific mission arise you've got to go and kill 40 orcs um, and it's got a bonus objective as you can see in the top corner two out of five combat drains so combat drain is you'll see I'll grab them by the face and kind of suck their life essence out. I've got to do that five times. I don't have to but I get a, a bonus for doing it. There it is there. Combat drain. So um, doing that will give you a bit of power back, a bit of life. Um, now you'll see that's a, a flurry attack. You'll see the right mouse button prompt come up for a counter. When spacebar comes up you can't counter those attacks. So you have to roll out of the way, dodge or flip over the top of them like I just did with that guy and that guy. Um, but yeah, just you'll end up just killing, 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 killing because it, it's a lot of fun. Even being all stealthy as well is actually really, really cool fun. Um, you'll sneak through different areas and, and hide and just pop out and take a couple down. Uh, you've got big beasties you can burn around on. Um, this game is just really cool. It's on sale at the moment on Bundle Stars, they're doing their summer sale so well worth if you've got a spare couple of bucks go and pick it up it's only four dollars and for the game of the year edition and this is yeah lord of the rings style of assassin's creed is great um there's yeah it's just really good um i haven't played it for a couple of weeks i've been playing so many other games from when i did this this has just been sitting there waiting for me to actually get the time to be able to do a video uh, life has a way of happening um but yeah, definitely well worth checking out. Uh, it's just so brutal. <laughs> That's a, a double counter you can get. You're actually kind of mixed with this elven dude. Uh, I don't want to give up too much of the storyline or anything for anybody that's into Lord of the Rings and wants to delve into the story. But you kind of play as a guy... Well, I mean, I've got the skin of a chick in this one because she looks awesome. You play as the, this guy that's kind of dead but not dead and you're mixed together with this elven dude and he can do different abilities it's him that does the combat drain technically and he can do a counter as well if you're trying to counter somebody that's attacking you and then you get another guy attack you at the same time you can double counter and he'll pop out and do that he also helps with the flurry attack which you see there but yeah um well worth checking out it's an awesome game so I, as you can see, I'm at 36 out of 40, only 4 kills to go, and then that's this mission. The brutal kill shots! 
also the photo editor is a lot of fun to play with as well uh, you, it's hard to time it so you want to bind it to maybe an extra mouse button or something but it's it's kind of cool the different things you can do and change it so yeah this is shadow of mordor game of the year edition check it out go and grab it four bucks worth it but until next time yeah enjoy ah, off with your head